G'day, welcome back to 7 Days to Die. It's the morning of day 47. So even though we can't make any laser guns or, or anything just yet, there is one thing I have forgotten about the laser workbench. And that is the fact that we can combine things past level 50 now. So I've done that with the laser sword. Um, and there's a few other things that we'll be able to combine and, and get them up to, um, well, as close to 80 as possible, which is the max quality. All right, let's have a look at the laser tool. Mm, I might just repair these. Yeah, it just takes an energy cell and I don't lose quality because it's under level 51. And that way, and, and that way we'll get more out of it. There we go. Level 80. Um, we could do crowbar. The titanium knife, I don't actually need that. I keep forgetting that I can use the laser sword to, to harvest. So I think I might just keep the laser sword there and we'll just ditch this for now. Negative two seconds. Okay. Yeah, cool. Let's make uh, four of them, I guess. There we go. Um, let's make let's make one for future repairs. Oh, you get an additional mod slot when it goes to eighty. That is cool. So that is maxed out now. Light attacks one hundred and two point four. Heavy attacks one hundred and eighty nine point nine. Yeah, it's pretty good. Nice, right, so here we go. Uh, also, we could make the Fusion Forge, right? Oh, that's uh, going to take quite a bit of titanium. Um, we could smelt some more, though, because we've got some raw. Yeah, and we're going to go down and get some titanium probably tomorrow anyway, so let's, uh, let's smelt this up. I think we need clay, yeah. Okay, so how are we looking here? Okay, these fully are fully grown now. I might, I'll leave these guys until these are fully grown. Uh, I did not plant any seeds here. Oh, these are done. We got little chickens in here. Okay, so we need to grab some animal feed, right? Because we've got to reload them. Which I think I put in the seeds. Yeah. Wow. Holy shit. I... 58 eggs? <laughs> I, d I don't think we're going to need any more for a little while. Uh, no, fuck it. We'll, we'll probably go on a big... Um, a big cooking like mission and we'll cook a whole bunch of stuff so probably want to get as many eggs as possible I should probably work out exactly what I need because I'm probably going to use more corn and potatoes than most of this other stuff so it doesn't make a lot of sense to have to plant these seeds you know just willy-nilly um, one thing I do I do need to do is actually finish off the irrigation pipe here. So let's do that. I know I've got some now. Uh, we don't need the junction.
There we go. That's everything irrigated. Uh, we should probably probably get some trees planted. Place some mushrooms there. Just to get a little bit... I mean, those two spots will give us 12 mushrooms each harvest. Which is enough to make more seeds. Um, okay, so I, I'm thinking... We continue on this theme here with a raised platform heading out that way with an orchard on top and that'll give us more room to expand this out and we could put more of a garden in which means I need to make some more pillars. So the next horde is going to be Day 50 at the earliest, day 53 at the latest, and I'm gonna just go insane difficulty for it. Like, we may as well, we're only one off, you know, being max difficulty, so let's just do it. And then I will probably change the horde timer as well to, to speed up the hordes a little bit. We might go from like every five to seven days so we could get an early horde uh, but not too early not not three days okay where are we gonna plant these trees oh i've got to get rid of those sheets i'm thinking we put maybe five blocks in between each tree it doesn't matter if it hangs over the edge, so we can have it fairly close to the back. Um, speaking of which, let's finish this off. That's five, so we would need to go one more block just to get two trees. <laughs> uh, one, two, three, four, five. It would be there. That's not too bad. We'll probably get a little bit of an overhang. Over, over the pathway, but yeah, that's all right. So we could do two rows and extend this out. Trouble is we're gonna need to go really far to get 12 trees. Unless we cut the garden off and continue the trees going this way. So this is another 25 farm plots. And I think that'd probably be enough if I, if I properly like balance this garden to give us the shit that we need. All right, let me, let me get the rest of these pillars out so we know exactly what we're working with here. Okay, that is that all sorted out. Let's get these down. Okay, so that's a gap of five. That's a gap of five. That actually works out pretty good, right? So that gives us six trees at least. Uh, and then we can carry this on. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Ah, oh, damn. We would need to expand this out just one more block. That doesn't give us all the trees, though, does it? Um, we've got... That's... Like, those three are apple. Those three are oranges. Then we've got three for bananas and then we we've only got one for coconut okay so i'm kind of changing shit around here i'm not a huge fan of going in front of the garden like this like i just i feel like it, it cuts us off like we can't we can no longer expand in that direction even though we probably won't need to it just, I don't know, it bothers me so much cutting myself off like that. 
Um, as well as that, like, okay, so if we have a ring of grass around this guy, this becomes the path. So that's, this is the actual path, which lines up with that one. And then we can have stairs. So that's where we need to plant that. This is five blocks out. That's five blocks out. And then if we want to do a second row, that's, um, okay, so grass, path, then what, just nothing? Path, I guess? Path, grass, plant. Grass, path. So I need to extend out this far. And I will need to do the same with that path as well. That will need to come out to here. And that's going to be quite a lot of weight on this overhang. This is three three blocks out. No, four blocks out from the from the pillar. At that point, I'm I'm looking at putting another pillar down. Oh, I need some more concrete blocks as well. This is the last of that thousand that I made. So this, we got to extend out this far, but this isn't going to give us enough room for another tree, is it? Because it'd be, that's the, the three gap, then there's a space, and then that's where the tree plants there. There's no pathway around the back. So now we've just got this massive open space back here. I could push everything back, but then all the trees are sunken back. You know, like... I like it like this because it's all... Everything's lined up. The pathway lines up. The stairs line up. Unless we go... Four, four blocks between the trees. I'm just, uh, the reason I, I chose five is because I'm worried about how close you can place them to the point where like, you know, they won't grow. I thought five would be a, a pretty good gap. That would give plenty of room, but maybe, like I said, I think vanilla trees only, only need three blocks or something in between them. Maybe it's like that. So if we were to shorten this by one block so that would be the two blocks in between then there's a gap and then we place the tree gap path that gives us three three rows and we utilize all the space so that might be the way to go and that gives us a, a total of four blocks in between each tree. All right, I've got to get some more concrete blocks on the go anyway. Uh, I think I was making... Oh, no, I was making sand. Oh, yeah. That is bloody amazing timing. Concrete shapes, do another thousand. I know I'm going to need them. Alright, cool. We got the first of our fusion forges. Oh, I forgot these are bloody two blocks. Shit. Um, we're going to block that. Maybe we don't need it. I mean, two's going to be enough. We'll just have four of these ones. Two fusion forges. 
All right, let's get the uh, parts for them. We can combine this armor as well. 56, that's it. <laughs> oh, that sucks. I tell you what, rather than selling this military gear, I, I'd be more inclined to just dismantle it all. We'd also have these ones here we can put into it. 66, that's not bad. Uh, so we need two more pillars. Yeah, two more pillars. Uh, okay, so this is a path. We'll just continue this on. And then we've got a gap of two. We plant there. Then there's two. We plant there. And then we've got all this open space back here. Shit. So that only gives us three. Three by three, which would be a field of nine. Nine trees. <clears throat> it's not really enough. I think we're going to need another pillar, unfortunately. Or we could extend out this way. Like, that is a possibility. Um, probably can't plant one there, though. I need, to get, I need to get some food. Okay, do we need the extra 25 slots in this farm? Because what we could do... That would be grass, and then this would be a path. What we could do is fill that in. So we get 20 farm plots. And then we could... Um, that's the gap of two. We plant there. Actually, I might double stack these just so I can see where the trees are actually planted. Because it's getting a little bit confusing now. Uh, technically, this would actually become the path. So we got four there. Nine here. That's 13 trees. We could do like four apples and then three of the other three. But there is a little bit of extra wasted space over here. Like yeah, all down here is a fairly big path. That's, it's not that bad though. So having three a uh, three wide path here actually matches this. So we could just have some stairs here that lead up to it. That might be pretty cool. And then this leads around the back. Um, it's a single path for around the back here. Uh, that's, a, yeah, a bit of a wasted space there. Not much I can do about it, though. I I think that's, that's it. I think the orchard is planned out. So this would have to become a path, I think. Oh, Jesus, that scared the shit out of me. Um, and then maybe stairs here. <clears throat> or we could remove this block. Continue the stairs on, and then we could have like a, a sloped stair set. Like a, like an angle angle angled uh, stair set like right there, so it comes around and wraps around the corner. That might look pretty cool. Yeah, so it would look like that. 
Anyway. Let's end, end the episode here. Farm's looking pretty good. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Catch you tomorrow.